1983, some scuba divers in Lake Coeur d'Alene discovered this canoe in the bottom, in about 20 feet deep of water, filled them with rocks, and they, when they got it up onto the shore, they realized that it was something old, and they figured it, figured it was an old Indian canoe of over 100 years old. Mm -hmm. Stories went out in the newspapers all over. They'd found this old Indian canoe in Lake Coeur d'Alene, and it even ended up on the uh, Harvey, I mean, I forgot his name, but the Harvey show anyway. And uh, he uh, this found out later that uh, the gentleman whose picture is in the bottom of the canoe there, Mr. John Kildow, made this canoe in 1938 as a 13 year old boy. His neighbors here in Post Falls uh, had a tree fall in their yard, and he asked if he could have that tree. And they said, yes, if he kept their lawn mowed and their garden weeded, he could have that tree. And with a hammer, a chisel, a hatchet, and a crosscut saw that his father gave him on his 12th birthday, he carved this out. His dad, who was George Kildow, was the uh, superintendent of schools here in Post Falls in, the, in those days, and uh, also one of the founding fathers of what we now call North Idaho College. He uh, also and some other people owned, owned some property on Coeur d'Alene Lake and had a youth camp there. And we have a picture over here of John and, and uh, his friends playing in this canoe on Lake Coeur d'Alene back in 1938. When they tied the boat to a, a tree that uh, fall, when they came back the following year, it was gone. They never could figure out what happened to the boat. Well, as it turns out, they figure some neighboring kids had pu pushed it out into the lake and filled it full of rocks so that it would stay in the bottom of the lake. It laid in the bottom of the lake from 1938 to 1983, 45 years. So it's semi-petrified and will probably last till the end of time. 